Today, we're gonna talk about eggs. So, egg prices are going a little crazy right now. So what's a good way to preserve some eggs that last a couple years even on your shelf in a cool, dark area? So, you know, first you wanna get yourself some farm fresh eggs, eggs that have not been washed because you do not want that bloom gone. The bloom is what is gonna protect these eggs and help keep them for those two years. One thing you will wanna get is like a rag or something and just go around your eggs, make sure they're free of like poop, debris, but do not scrub away your bloom. Just get off those little areas and things will be good. Next, what you're gonna to wanna to get yourself is a glass jar. It doesn't matter what size your jar is, if it will hold 12, 24, whatever you want it to do. So, a lot of people reuse like those big old pickle jars. What I'm using is just a jar that I happen to get on clearance at Walmart years ago. And we're gonna use this one. Next, what you're gonna want is some pickling, or not pickling, lime. <laughs> lime is what you're gonna want. A lot of times it's called pickling lime. That's why I thought about it. But lime. What you're gonna need is one ounce of pickling lime to one quart of water. One ounce of this is about two and a half tablespoons. Um, what you really should do is get yourself a digital scale and a food grade scale that can make sure you're at an ounce. Cause lime, I don't know if you can over lime or under lime, but just keep it at an ounce per quart, please. Just makes life a lot easier. So next, all we're gonna do is you're going to carefully put your eggs in your jar. You do not want to crack any of your eggs. Because if you crack the eggs, they will go bad and it will smell horrendous whenever you go to open these things again. So right now, all I'm doing is adding some eggs around, seeing how many we can fit in this thing. And then I will add my water and my lime. Oh, I wanna keep that one. That one is really cool looking. Look at that, it's cool size. That looks like it would've been painful to get out. But I wanna keep that one, see if it has to be one of them two yokers. We love those. They're a lot of fun. <laughs> and kids like to make a wish on the two yoker. So right now we're at 11. Shoot, I'm gonna have to go break into my other. I forgot how many I could fit in here. So these are ones that I've had in the fridge. I have not washed off the bloom or anything. I just tend to grab them and then go from there. I got another one in there that I might have to use too. I'm surprising myself how much I'm getting in here today. We got one more. Make sure I can shut that well. Cool, so we fit in, let's see, 24 plus what was that, five? So about 29 eggs in here, so that's pretty awesome. So, now what I'm gonna do is I am going to add one ounce of pickling lime to one quart of water. And I'm going to stir that up. And now, this won't dissolve completely and that is A-OK. -okay. There's nothing wrong with that. Make it look kind of like a milky substance. And you want to make sure you cover 
all your eggs. So we're gonna have to go in with the next quart here. And since I got some stuff on the bottom here, I wanna make sure I get all that. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna add this second ounce. Just stirring it up a little bit. Release a fine powder in the air. You probably shouldn't be bringing that in. And then make sure you cover up those eggs. So my eggs are completely covered. And then I just shut it. And now these are ready to go into a cool, dark place. Um, our pantry is just fine. That's usually where we store a lot of our canning goods is in our pantry or others. So this will last you for two years and you don't even have to can it or nothing. Um, that lime is what helps preserve it with the bloom. You can just take them out. They taste just fine. They taste pretty normal. Um, the only thing I've ever noticed with water glass and an egg is that it will sometimes like you make it scramble, it'll be just a little flatter, maybe smidge runnier. But besides that, they taste great. It's a wonderful way to preserve some eggs, especially if you can get some cheap. Um, we just got some from a farmer in our church and it was so wonderful. So get out, get you out there and water bath some eggs. Water glass some eggs. <laughs> Bye.